Hello, this is a instructional video on how to set up the TEU-105 BK ESC made by Tamiya. It is included in many of their uh, newer car kits and this is the M05 chassis mini that I'm building at the moment. It's quite simple to set up once you know how, but until you know how it's quite hard. So first thing you do is turn on your transmitter, your controller, and then turn on your receiver, the ESC. You should then get, uh, you should then press the set button for more than 0.5 seconds, one half a second, until you get a steady flashing light. Then put it on full acceleration and press it again. And as you can see, we now have a double flash LED. Now put it on full reverse and press it again. So now that is set up and ready to go. I'll be showing you how to troubleshoot for this in a minute if you can't work out why yours isn't working. So this is what your car should be like if it's been programmed properly. Press full ahead, full acceleration forwards and full backwards, full acceleration backwards. So this is all working and ready to go. So troubleshooting the ESC. Um, if the car is making a beeping sound, it sounds like it's coming from the motor and the red LED on the ESC is flashing, or if the red LED is flashing. I think it means that there is a problem with the receiver not receiving the signals being sent from the transmitter. This can happen to a number of reasons and it was really annoying me until I found out what was up with mine. What was happening with mine was I had a different radio crystal in my controller to in my receiver so it wasn't receiving the right signal. Both in your transmitter and receiver they need to be the same frequency. The ESCs are very rarely break so it's unlikely to be the ESC that's broken. Um, however the receiver and transmitter sometimes more commonly break but again it's unlikely to be this just make sure that your um, the wire coming from the ESC is plugged into the channel 2 slot on your receiver mine is an A comes on and therefore your uh, servo cable is plugged into channel 1 it's, you don't need a separate power source on your receiver because it's powered by the ESC which is a feature I think that's only on the TEU-105 TEU BK ESC, maybe a couple of models earlier. So don't have to worry about putting a power cable on. But other than that, make sure your battery is connected. Make sure that your um, transmitter is turned on before you turn on the power for the ESC. And although it doesn't really matter, make sure your motor cables are unplugged if you're not raising the vehicle. On the controller another thing I've seen is to make sure that that is in the middle, your throttle trim. This makes, well I don't know quite what it does but apparently that can cause problems when you're programming if uh, it's not quite in the middle. So other than that there shouldn't be any many other problems. It's quite simple to set up and it's hopefully going to be a lot of fun to drive. I have some footage on my channel of me driving it or whatever I'm going to try, try and fit an onboard camera so have a look at my channel see ya, bye